A kick with a broom. Ah, good morning, Jimmy. Fine day for it. For what? Well, for whatever innocent folk like we can find to do up here on the rooftops. Have you ever fallen down? Oh, yes. Or tons of times. Well, if you don't want a repeat performance, try shutting up. Ah, the day is coming when people like you will have to look up to folk like me. Probably easiest from the ground, then. What? Looking up at you, I mean. Probably easiest when done from the ground. Actually, I, I think I might just get in as little looking up at you right now, in fact. I'll just go down to street level in a quite orderly fashion, then, shall I? Let's keep track of that. From the Assassin's Guild, I presume. Did you get the number of that donkey cart? Thomas Silverfish, Alchemist Extraordinaire. That drain pipe leads into the alchemist's shop. Maybe it's to let the fumes out or something. It's the door. The door to the alchemist's shop. Well, I never. By the cut of his jib, I'd say the man's an alchemist. Well, either that or a professional jib cutter. I could watch that for hours. The Eureka! I found it. Finally, it works. My octocellulose has been perfected. What works? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing works at all. Oh, go on, you were saying something right now. No, I wasn't. It was all about octo-something. Shh! Not so loud. All right. But wizard's oath on this. You have to swear to keep all this a secret. Oh, all right. Well? Well, what? Well, let's hear it then. It's a secret oath. I promise I won't listen. No, that's no good. Tell you what, I'll have to say it in mime. Well, you can't say further than that. Anyway, here before you, you see a new age in entertainment. With my new octocellulose, I'll revolutionise the world. Think of it. Pictures that move. Eh? My fortune is made. Moving pictures will soon be the talk of the age. You've been standing too close to the boiling mercury again, haven't you? Every true genius has his vice. It helps us to get ahead. Putting your head in a vice is the best idea you've had all day. Moving pictures. How does it work? Well, the strips of octocellulose are transparent. When you paint on them and shine light through from behind, it projects a picture onto a wall. You just run the strip through a box filled with gears and springs. It's a bit noisy. Ah, the clicking noise is all part of the atmosphere. What paints the pictures? There's an imp inside this box. All I do is open up the window and the imp makes the pictures. He paints the frames as fast as I can wind the strips past him. 
An imp, eh? Hmm. Anyway, what are you going to call this new system? Nah, I'm... I'm not sure. Well, it's easy enough. What is their most unique characteristic? They're moving pictures that click. Well, there you go. Call them that. Of course. Clickies. Thank you. Clickies? Looks like a little home for a very little creature. The cable release. I wonder what it releases. Maybe it's a little home. Hmm. The world just swims with possibilities. That doesn't work. That looks a bit hot. Someone should do something about that. There are some things best left unknown. What's in here then? Looks like cooking oil. corn. Funny little blighter. By the cut of his jib, I'd say the man's an alcohol. Well, either that or a I have absolutely no desire to talk to that person at this time. Lots of little pictures, and there's little holes in the sides. Indoor plumbing. Now, whoever said Ank Moorpork lacked all the mod cons? to a common house mouse, if I'm not mistaken. You're not mistaken. Wanted for arson, suspect approximately three tons, 200 feet long, scaly. Wanted dead, definitely dead. Reasonable reward. Lost, small dog, answers to the name of Gaspode. Talks too much, if found, keep. Counterwise wine tasting at Bear Huggers Wineries. Please bring buckets to winery the day before you arrive. Aha! Crocus Gittus, or the common old garden boring old codger. <laughs> 